Welcome to the weekly and welcome to my Hermitage studio here on the south shores of Boston, Massachusetts. I was actually going to shoot this week's weekly uh, at the pottery itself because there are a lot of new pieces I want to show you, but there was uh, a lot of commotion there today uh, and it was too noisy to do a video there and, and I wanted to leave and come back to the solitude of my hermitage here uh, on Rexham Beach. So uh, it'll be a short video today, but there are two important people I wanted to give shout outs to. First of all, Roman, he is a Benedictine monk at St. John's Abbey and uh, in Collegeville, Minnesota, which is also a university. Uh, they run a university there. Uh, he contacted me, uh, I think it was last week, expressing interest in carrying uh, some of my pottery at the Abbey Bookstore. And I wanted to thank you for that and thank you for your inquiry. And uh, you will be receiving information. You were requesting to see more samples of work and you'll be getting those samples along with a very unique sample that is designed specifically for St. John's Abbey. Uh, St. John's Abbey, for those who are not familiar with this monastery, it is one of the biggest in the country and actually in the world. Uh, St. Vincent's is actually larger than St. John's, but St. John's is right with St. Vincent's. Um, the unique aspect about St. John's, and I did a video on St. John's months ago when I was there. I visited their pottery. They have a world-renowned pottery, and it's reflective of how that abbey is so deeply rooted in the arts. The arts are very, throughout the history of monasticism, the arts has been integral to the monastery itself, and St. John's is a prime example of that. And so I wanted to create a piece uniquely catering to your bookstore, Roman, and uniquely reflective to the setting of St. John's because you have so much fabulous architecture on that property and I'm creating a piece of pottery that is reflective of, of that architecture and that will specifically, specifically fit the needs of your bookstore. And that will be arriving to you next week, so keep your eye open for that. The other individual I would like to do a shout out today is uh, Joseph, Brother Joseph from Glastonbury Abbey, and he also runs uh, the bookstore there in the gift shop. And he has started carrying uh, my plaques and my pottery there. So if you're unable to travel all the way out here in uh, down big downtown Mecca of Marshfield uh, to see my uh, pottery and the gallery that I have in my pottery, uh, please do, if you're closer to Glastonbury Abbey, uh, bookstore and gift shop, go there and you'll see it there and you can purchase it right there uh, with Brother Joseph's help. So again, a shout out to Brother Joseph. Thank you for carrying my pottery. And I'm looking forward to, be, to being in even more monasteries uh, because of the background that I have and how important I think monasteries are. And I think my, my pottery that I'm doing is very reflective of, of the monastic charism. So I think uh, that's it for this week. I'm not in my pottery, so I don't have a whole lot of product to show you. I have a huge firing that's happening this week. So next Saturday, I will have lots of new product uh, for you to uh, look at and experience. So until next week, stay creative, and I will see you then.